sensorial graded plane shapes. The plane shapes come in the three foundation shapes of triangles, square and circles and are presented in the primary colours of red, blue and yellow. Today we will require two different colours for our um, presentations and we're going to be using red and blue. For the first presentation we're going to choose one of the shapes and I think we'll work with the triangles first. So remove all of the triangles from the box and place them randomly on your workspace. Choose your largest shape and place it to the left. We're going to grade them from largest to smallest. With the bottoms aligned. We've arranged our triangles from largest down to smallest. All right, then mess them up and offer the child a turn. Would you like a turn now? Graded plane shapes, filling with the shapes. For this exercise, we'll need two colours of the same, sh two shapes in different colours. So I'm going to choose the square shapes in red and blue. We'll remove the pieces. And then grade them as we did before. For the next part of the exercise, we're going to stack them concentrically, but we're going to be alternating the colours. Begin with your large shape. And then on top of this one, I'll be placing a blue one. On top of this one, the red one. So we're alternating the colours. And there we have the alternate the stats of the squares. If you look down upon the top of those stats, you'll be, from an aerial point of view, you'll notice that it's the same point of view as an aerial view of the pink tower and that the dimensions of the squares are the same as the bases of the pink tower. 
Greater plane shapes, exercise three. You'll begin as before by aligning two shapes, but this time we're going to be creating a different pattern. Begin with one shape. And place them just so. It's still a concentric pattern. with a Beautiful design. 